Remember this, as artists, nothing defines you. Nothing defines you except you, right? Employment does not define you as an artist. Exercise your right of self-determination and try to tap into that which is authentic and true and spiritual and go out into the world and change it. The role of art is very important in society. It is not something that we just uh, participate in as a means of entertainment. The role of art in society is what thoughts are to the individual. When you reflect on who you are, who you hope to be, your failures, your triumphs, what those thoughts are to the individual, art is to the society as a whole. We gather in a hall like this and see performances and hear music and see drama so that we collectively can think about who we are, who we hope to be, our failures, our triumphs, decide what our values are and move people to then go out and act on those values. That's an important and valuable and a spiritual thing and a great gift that your professors and teachers have given you. Take those bricks and build the house that you want to live in as you go out into the world. And to the drama students, a point of personal privilege. I guess this applies to all the artists here. Arthur Miller said it the best. There's a certain immortality in the theater not given to you by monuments or books, but the knowledge an actor takes with them to their dying day, that on a certain afternoon in a dusty theater, they cast the shadow of a person that was not themselves, but the unsung heart songs that the common man feels but never utters, they gave voice to, and doing that, they somehow joined the ages. You are now going out into the world. Join the ages. <laughs>